Why, hello, fellow Patriots, and welcome back to the Patriot Dad channel, where we can discuss current events, modern issues, and culture, all while keeping it as real as possible. Today, we're going to be doing a first-time reaction to a new artist on the channel, Playboy the Beast. His song, 1776, was recommended to us by channel friend Shannon Garcia, so thank you again for the recommendations. If you do see a little bit of a difference in the camera, I am messing with a few different camera settings to try and get better in post. So bear with me. Let's get the video pulled up and let's react to it, shall we? Tired of the bullshit, about to pull a 1776 in this bitch, yeah. So we the people tired of the bullshit, about to pull a 1776 in this bitch, yeah. 1776, what we up against? 1776, fuck the government. 1776, what we up against? 1776, fuck the government, yeah. Just take a look around you, we the people waking up because we tired of the bullshit. Safe to say we've had enough. Stop the government telling us it ain't really had enough, man. You Oh man, before we get too far into it, so far, I'm actually really enjoying this. It's a little more mellow paced, but overall the message is great. 1776 for real. Things are getting a little bit dicey out there, everybody. So make sure you keep your head on a swivel and pay attention to what's happening because it doesn't seem like it's going to end well. So make sure you also get out and vote. Back it up a couple of seconds, maybe 10 seconds. 1776, fuck the government, yeah. Just take a look around you, we the people waking up Because we tired of the bullshit, safe to say we've had enough Stop the government telling us it ain't really adding up And you don't have to be a genius to see that they're all corrupt So put your middle fingers up if you're riding with Trump And if you're really about this life, I think it's time to raise up We wouldn't be in this position if they really gave a fuck But they don't, the tree of liberty is in need of blood These traitors hating on the net, they trying to say I'm not a patriot I love my fucking country and it's played and they just hating it Calling me a Cause I rap out trying to save this shit A true soldier or guy but I'm surrounded by these Satan But I'll be ready for whatever Really ride with Trump forever We the people come together We can overcome these devils I believe freedom's a treasure Never concede to the pressure 1776 it's time to make our country better So like overall I really like the look in the video Face tattoos really aren't my thing But hey who am I to judge I've got some random tattoos of my own But the overall message is great He loves his country I love my country I think most of us do, but a lot of us love the country the way that it is. We aren't trying to make it something that it's not, and I think that's so important. A lot of us over the years, myself included, have fought for this country. Whether in the end we agree or disagree on the motivation for why we ended up fighting somewhere overseas, because we all know they weren't great wars, but the corruption back home now is so extreme that it just can't be ignored anymore. So. Like I said, make sure you get out there and vote. Let's get back into it. Back up a couple of seconds. Freedom's a treasure, never concede to the pressure. 1776, it's time to make our country better. We the people tired of the bullshit, about to pull a 1776 in this bitch, yeah. So we the people tired of the bullshit, about to pull a 1776 in this bitch, yeah. 1776, what we up against? 1776, fuck the government. 1776, what we up against? 1776, fuck the government, yeah. I wrote this verse to let y'all know Joe Biden sucks. And if you got a problem with that, you can suck my nuts. Cause it's 2024, baby, you know we ride with Trump. And if you vote for Biden, my best guess is you're a cuck. I got some people hating on me cause I said let's close the border. But I'm not against my people, I'm just wanting law and orders. We got millions of people invading us from other countries. Many living off the system that comes from our tax money. But they say that I'm a traitor and I'm trying to be Caucasian. I just want my country safer for the children that I'm raising. This is the situation that Joe Biden has created, but I know you Democrats ain't ready for that conversation. But I said... Oh, so the nice message here is that he is saying that he's being accused of being Caucasian because he's standing for a closed border. He's not saying no immigration, he's just saying controlled immigration, protect the country. Also, the point he kind of alludes to is that there have been people from over 100 different countries of origin coming across our southern border. So it's not like he's just talking about Mexicans coming across the border. He's talking about people from all over the world. If they enter our country in an uncontrolled, unmonitored fashion, 
we have no way to prevent bad people coming in. I think those chickens are going to come home to roost sooner than later, and then everybody that's a Democrat is going to act surprised when something bad happens. They're also going to call all of us racist for pointing out that we told you so. So, you can mark that down today, folks. I'm going to tell you so. Something very bad is going to happen because of uncontrolled, unfettered, illegal immigration coming across our southern border. It's just going to happen. It's unfortunate. I really don't want it to. But what else is going to happen? We have no control over who's coming into our country. It's not going to end well. Just not. That Joe Biden has created, but I know you Democrats ain't ready for that conversation. But I said what the fuck I said, and I'm standing on it. Anything I say you do, best believe I'ma own it. And I ain't never switching up or backing down. No, I'ma fight, and I would never be ashamed, cause in my heart I know I'm right. We the people tired of the bullshit, about to pull the 1776 in this bitch, yeah. So we the people tired of the bullshit, about to pull the 1776 in this bitch, yeah. 1776, what we up against? 1776, fuck the government. 1776, what we up against? 1776, fuck the government, yeah. Oh, that was a really good song. I actually really appreciate that because it's not just some other random white guy saying it. You can't ignore us all forever. This uncontrolled immigration is a big problem. Like I said, FJB, Trump 2024. I don't know what else there is to say. Hopefully we can turn this thing around before it becomes a total unmitigated disaster. But thank you everyone who made it to the end of this video today. I greatly appreciate it. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up and leave a comment below. If you liked this reaction and want to see more videos like this on the channel, please make sure that you subscribe, click the little bell icon, and select all notifications so that you can be notified when I upload additional content to this channel. Share the video with friends and family to help spread the word. And like I said, make sure you get out there and vote in November and whenever your state's primaries are this year. If you have a recommendation for a future song or topic you'd like to see on this channel, please make sure you leave it in a comment below as most videos on this channel do come from viewer recommendations from people just like you. Thank you very much for all your past recommendations. I greatly appreciate them. I hope you have a wonderful week. Take care, everyone. God bless and bye for now. Go ahead and check out one of the links on the screen now to either subscribe to the channel and see the rest of the videos of the channel or one of the carefully selected videos that you may wish to see that YouTube has used its algorithm to select for you.